Everybody, it's me, Gaz, with another video. This time I have a uh, this time I have a review video on the brand new zombie series. So let's get into it. At the start of the video, I had already done my unboxing, so she's right here in front of me. So let's go. So here is one of the new dolls. Uh, her her name in this series it for the. Zombies for our series 2, uh, Wild Vibes. This is so clingy. This is her name. She's a blonde. She has a translucent blue stand. She comes with a pair of shorts that are actually very, very hard to get on. I have, I had such a struggle with that. Uh, she comes with sunglasses and she comes with this cute little octopus friend that clings to her. You can put him literally anywhere on her body and it's honestly so adorable. Okay. So this is her. So in my personal opinion, I think she's also shot to you drop from the first set. I don't know if they are doing um completely different girls or if it's the same girls, they just have different names, which, you know, neat concept, but I feel like it's the same girl. Do you agree or disagree? Let me know in the comments. So, all right, I'm going to put her to the side. Here is this series' uh, tissue paper. Uh, this is where all of the accessories are. It is a white tissue paper with black accent, uh, bones, hearts, uh, skulls. They got like different skull types here. So you got a human skull, you have like a teddy bear, a uh, monkey, uh, like a pig. There's a cat or dog, depending. Um, I'm not sure what this one is. I think it's like a bug. But yeah, so this is super cute. I, I kept, I kept the original paper. I'm going to keep this one. Super adorable. Love it. I'm probably going to put that in my curly journal. That is going to be a curly journal thing. Okay. So let's also now get into the box styles. So here is Series 1's box. Uh, this was Shop to Your Drops box. I'm going to take her card off because I'm going to find out something out about that in a bit. So the original box was a full purple box with pops of color. And after Siri seeing Series 2's box, I realized how much we're kind of missing on this. So there are actual details that you kind of lose in the background because it is purple. So like it's like a dark purple and like you, you lose the details of the, of the wooden coffin behind everything. Cause like there's supposed to be wood grain and everything, but it's really hard to see at like, you know, not really at a distance, but like when you're kind of looking at it, you, you miss those finer details. Not, not that there's anything wrong with this, but it's like it's a good color, it's a good box. But now seeing series two, I realize how much we, we, we were missing. So series two is a white top with pink. And because of all of the color they're giving you, like all of the different like leaves, flowers, mushrooms, the paw prints, the claw marks, the different skeletons, the fact that you can see the wood grain because it's not sitting on pink. It's sitting, oops, I didn't mean to bump the camera. It's sitting on a, like a, on a, on a gradient of blue, yellow, pink, you know, color. And you can see the wood grain. You can see the detailing on this. Like, I think this was a much better palette, like color palette choice than the initial box. But, you know, agree, disagree. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. All right, next thing is a weird choice was the cards. The cards are pretty much the same. Um, they're, act, you know, this one's accented with purple, this one's accented with pink, and they have these little, like, little decals at the bottom for the characters. And like I said, this is clearly the same character to me, but who knows? <laughs> um, one of the things about this is the choice. So on the back of this card, it's super easy to read and understand uh, what this card is. It is Shop to You Drops likes and dislikes. So, like, she likes money and shopping and she likes makeup. She doesn't like spiders and she doesn't like tomatoes. Super simple and easy to understand, right? Like, you know, I 
everybody who reads this would understand. Okay, that's what she likes and dislikes. For series two, I don't understand what this is meant to represent. If they're doing something different this time around, it it's not really clear. It's not really apparent about what this is showing, like what these little bars mean. If someone has figured out what this means, please let me know in the comments so I, I can understand. Because I looked at this and I wasn't, I wasn't really sure. But yeah. And that's really it uh, for this review of the new zombies. I'm excited to get more. Zombies is such a cool concept and I love them so much. But let me know in the comments about your opinions. Agree or disagree with me. Like, let me know how you guys feel about this. And I'll see you guys later.